There are many great homes, but I've found every prestigious neighborhood has one revered home that the city, the community, and the neighbors love. In Preston Hollow, it's the Crespi Estate, designed by Maurice Fascio. In Volk Estates, it is a home designed by Ohio architect John Scudder Atkins. In Lakewood, this is definitely the much-loved iconic estate home. Designed by society architect Anton Korn, its 5,000 square feet reflect the grandiosity of its time, and its refinement reflects the elegance of any era. This architecturally significant Italian Renaissance home is further distinguished by its blue tile roof. The tile recently installed was created by the original tile maker from the 1930s. Three shades of blue tile were used to achieve the vivid depth of color. The carved stone detail, including a relief of an old derrick, is a tip of the hat to the industry and the wealth of the original owners who made this home possible in 1939. The plating windows with the stained glass transoms that march across the front of the house add additional architectural elegance. As you enter the home, the space opens with sight lines into several rooms. The spectacular wrought iron banister and balustrades of the staircase anchor the entrance hall. You will also notice that the intricate carved ceiling of the entrance hall changes in the living room to the beam ceiling with a refined and subtle motif. I love the even spaced arched openings wrapping around the home. They expand the space and tie together the entrance hall, living room, music room, and informal living room with sunlight flooding the space. Going through the home is a visual treasure hunt. The carved stone on the exterior gives us a hint of what we would find on the inside. It's fun to discover the marble mantle and the fireplace surround and the gentle curved patterns of the double doors into the dining room. Homes that people love almost always have an abundance of sunlight. Here you're able to stand in one room and see sunlight in four different directions. Anton Korn tapped into the characteristics that make us happy in the home. This Lakewood home opens to nature where you hear the birds singing and the layered trees arching over the pool and gardens. And I love the formality of this walled garden. The connection to nature is accentuated on the master bedroom terrace. We're looking directly into trees and overlooking the pool and gardens. The dense perimeter of trees provides a natural visual barrier to other homes in the neighborhood that just disappear. It is also fun to see the original hand-painted soffits under the eaves. The master bedroom and master bathroom also extend in nature with double doors opening to the elevated terrace. The master bathroom also combines the original antique tile floors with the contemporary Ansex tile with the bathtub by Waterworks, known for merging European design with a modern aesthetic. Heated floors and automatic shades subtly add to the serenity of the space. The ball top kitchen, filled with sunlight, also combines the sleek design and technology of the 21st century with the clean lines and sleek, modern elements of this 1930s home. And why shouldn't an historic home have a European Miele induction cooktop, warm and drawer, dishwasher, and Gaginaw double oven, lever refrigerator, and Hoshishaki ice maker? Sleek can be delivered in many forms. In the dining room, these Venetian plaster walls gently curve around the corners, radiating their smooth luster. Going below grade, this space brings a smile. You will find museum quality air filtration, whole house water filtration system, and other mechanical systems that would be the envy of any engineer or environmentalist, or just those that love luxury. At this Lakewood home, you'll feel like you're in an endless estate because of the lush surroundings framing the formal and informal gardens, a pool, play areas, and terraces. And just a few blocks away is White Rock Lake, and only a few miles away, the Downtown Arts District. A beautiful site, a talented architect, the integrity and aesthetics of the 20th century, and a design interpreted by 21st century technology materials. This might be the very definition of an architecturally significant home.